Woohoo! Look at this. Catch it while it's clean and not beat up. I went and bought a Diamondback uh, seven-inch wet bench saw tile saw, Harbor Freight the other day uh, for my projects. This is going to be great. It's got a bar that guide that will slide and move, and you lock it down. The angle guide to cut angles comes off of the bar when you're not using it. It's got an adjustable blade and guard. This comes up a good bit more. Uh, let me move these real quick. Pretty good size water reservoir. Seven inch blade. It's it's pretty good. Now I've been saving a lot of marble and granite and all kinds of tile and stuff. I'm going to be cutting these into uh, cubes. Uh, at least this will be cubes. See, this thing's like an inch thick. I'm getting a sphere cutter that will go on my tabletop drill presses that will cut these into shooter marbles once I cut that into cubes. All the marble tile I've been recycling and saving is going to become uh, stands for coins and such. Uh, it's just a matter of cutting it, polishing it, and that'll be great. I picked these up recently. These are marble napkin rings, actually. They were four of them at a pawn shop. They were marked a dollar a piece. It's kind of a thrift store as well. Uh, I handed the lady a $10 bill, and she handed it to her son, who was working the register, and said, I need $8. And I'm like, no, you need 6 And she said, no, half price day. Uh, I'm going to cut these in half like this, you know, right down the blade here. And they will become eight sphere stands for uh, stone spheres that I cut. Uh, pretty cool. Even got an extra blade because I know I'm going to mess one up. Uh, cool deal. I'll let you know how things go with it when I start playing.